Hello and welcome back to another episode of The Illusion of Part 2. I'm here with Kaleo at 6am. We need to check all the rooms again. Yes, we do. I, I don't know. I've never seen any of these rooms change though. Well, no. maybe the bathroom doesn't count because whatever, but yeah. <sighs> Nothing changes. Trapdoors stay the same. Yeah, no, nothing, nothing's different in here in the garden. No, maybe it is the bathroom that changes. But you're checking it every hour. Oh, someone else is on the bathroom. It's not the dolphin. It's it's Steve. Oh, finally, the bathroom is available. I've been waiting for what feels like decades. <laughs> First, the door was locked, and then that constipated dolphin was hogging it up. But now it's all mine. <laughs> Here it comes, sweet relief. Oh. <laughs> okay. Is he gone? Yeah, he's gone. He blew through the ceiling. That was, you know, interesting, let's say. Are we going in there now? Are we not? No, yeah, we are. I think so. <laughs> oh, it's like a maze. Oh. Yeah. I'll go, I'll go straight, you go right. I can't swim straight right. This is a dead end. I'm drowning. What about air? Well, we're not drowning. Okay. Air runs out, but no damage. Okay. You went that way? I'll go, I'll go on the next right there. This is a dead end for dead sure. Dead end. Yep, dead end here too. So it's got to be over here. Yeah, that's... Your rain. Yep, yep, there's a there's an arrow down. Okay. Are you coming? Yeah. Okay. Uh, Articus. You fool I am Articus, first of my name and rightful ruler of the sea. D did you truly believe that you could enslave me and feed me mere fish food for the rest of eternity? Blasphemy. But I, who was eating Cypress's delectable bilberries all along, yeah, we figured. <laughs> now you shall pay for your defiance. So we're fighting a dolphin, but we can't get out of the water, right? Yeah. Oh, what I do is, do you have a countdown? Uh... Oh, okay, cannon bars, okay, it's shooting cannon bars at us. But we can kill the cannon bars, okay. But how are we, how are we fighting the dolphin? Three hearts. You need to hit the dolphin three times somehow. Oh no. Oh, you got hit. Four, five cannons fired? <laughs> oh, that's just a piece right up there. I'm already dead! That's not nice. I died too. I no idea what to do. Oh, this one's gonna fire. Oh, okay. And to look at which one's gonna fire and then stay yeah. away. Uh, over to the left here. Oh, now it's swimming. Oh, it hit. Also hits me underwater. <laughs> yeah, it just dodged. Oh, now we're fighting down. Uh, middle cannons are firing. Okay. Oh, it's normal cannons again. Once we can just actually add yeah, our hard now. That's what I think. Why does one blow up? I don't know. Uh, of if they touch you, they blow up, or after they run out of time, I guess. Yeah. Oh, TNT. Yeah, and guardians. I'm dead, I think. One more totem, I think. I'm really low health, though. I don't know. How? When do we hit the? the uh, what is this? Can you shoot that guy up here? No. How do, we, how do we hurt him? Me. Did we 
get a special item? No. Right now. No. Still the same. No. Still the same. Okay. It's more like knockback stick thing. What's this? Why is this making sound? Drown? Uh. Ah! Out of the water now? No. I don't know. This is confusing at best. As oh. always. Where's the okay. next air pocket? There. Not okay. Here. Right okay. here. Okay. I'm returning Wilson. here. Isn't that pool over there? Ground, drum, team team. When do we damage him? Just gonna die here. Eventually, because these the guardians are just awful to fight like this. With the thorns on top of everything else. damage here. Can't get close enough to hit them. Articles is not vulnerable. Okay, we need to fight him. Come here. I hit him once, and he lost a heart. Hit him again, hit him. Nope. Oh, not vulnerable anymore. This isn't yeah. the last you'll see of me. I know. Let me now get out. I don't know. I don't think so. You can only swim back up, right? Oh, yeah, you can jump out there. Okay. Did we hit him three times or did we hit him once and then he vanished? I think uh, we hit him once. Yeah, I tried to hit him again, but he wasn't vulnerable again. Okay. I mean, I definitely hit him once. The one hit connected and I saw a heart go away. Yeah. And I tried again, but it was very hectic. That was a very strange boss fight. There's some fire back here. I don't know why. Campfires. I don't know why they're here. I want to get in there. What's a dead end? I don't think there's anything here. And the quest is still just free roam. Something I don't seems know. off of this press fight. <laughs> What's with the campfires? Just a lot of campfires. It's just some smoke. But you don't even see it, do you? It gets blocked. <laughs> and there's nothing we can do with them, right? You don't have anything to cook. You don't have any food. We could cook golden apples. <laughs> Does this go anywhere? No. No. Check them all. All right. I yeah, guess you I just leave. But how? Swim up the thing. Okay. That's strange, though. I don't know. So we didn't really defeat him. He just left. <laughs> yeah, and then next time, the next hard, and then pass. <laughs> Yeah, I guess that's what we're doing. Uh, 23 gourd. I guess I'll buy some more totems. Those seem to be the most useful. 17. Honestly. Really? It said that you had three gourd on my screen. Oh, yeah. That's weird. Probably is. Yeah. 17 yeah. was yours. <laughs> okay. That makes sense. Sure. Uh, strength stuff. More gappers, maybe. How much gold do I have left? Ten. I'll buy... I'll buy everything I can. I think that's smart. So we know who eats the berries. We can talk to Cypress. 
whatever her name was, his name. You're telling me that it was the dolphin who was eating all my bilberries the whole time? That must be the most ridiculous story <laughs> I've ever heard. Doesn't matter, I suppose, as long as my bilberries are safe from future harm. I, are they? I don't know if they are. <laughs> what? You want me to give you some sort of key so you can continue on your quest to catch the illusioner? I don't have a key. <laughs> That's it. We get nothing. Question mark, question mark. <laughs> Go bother someone else with your problems. Man. Wow. <sighs> so rude, these people. So, who are it's we like the candy are over again. <laughs> Hope we can kill some people here too. <laughs> Let's look at. I mean, they're the ghosts already anyway. But does Charles have. Oh, Charles. What a glorious day. Now that those pipes are working, I can think clearly again. Oh, we cleared the pipes, I guess. Huh? Oh, good evening. What a fine specimen you are. What's that? You want to see my library? Why, of course. In fact, I'll show you around myself. I was opening to the next room. I am astounded that someone is actually interested in my book collection. I'm very interested, yeah. It has been centuries since I've met someone with the same seal for literature. Who is your favorite author? Wait, let me guess. Sure. Shakespeare? <laughs> Dickens? Perhaps Nabokov? Ha 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 ha. I'm just babbling on now. Am I not? Let me open the door up for you. Thanks, Charles. So what are we doing in here now? Free roaming. Of course, what else? <laughs> I found... There's, no, there's a lever here. And there's a lectern here. You should probably read that book. It's empty. Perfect. Maybe it's not empty at all times, though. Of course Maybe not. Time cover. I think there are two songs playing at once, and I don't like it. I hope it was two songs playing at once, otherwise it was just one weird song. <laughs> anyway. We can't get upstairs now. Uh, I don't see a way up. Unless there's like a ladder somewhere tucked away that I didn't see. I don't see one now. Hmm. All right, let's talk to Charles again, I guess. Maybe he has something to say. I hope that my correction is to your pleasure. Feel free to look around. And then I guess I'll do this too. It just does the countdown. I don't know what we need to do with that countdown, though. Something. There's something we're going to rush. We're going to have to rush to do. Hmm. So we the time traveler or we talk to... Who else could we talk to? To hmm. the, the guy, what's his name? It's not Vandal, it's the other one. <laughs> the brother. Yeah. Mr. Winston. No. I could never figure out what that level was for in the middle of the foyer. Yeah. yeah, I have no idea either. <laughs> Where's, Where's the dolphin gone? And where will we have to fight him again? I don't know. In the bathtub. So Steve's is just Steve's just gone, right? Gone, yeah. Francesco probably doesn't have to say it. <laughs> Something important. Uh, I guess we just time travel and then check again the the library or something. I don't know. So I, we have no time. Yeah, like there's nothing. We have no clues left, right? It's just uh, upstairs or downstairs. I'll go up. Okay. I'm staying down. Well, you, you do the storage room too. I mean, we know there's nothing there, but I wanted to check anyway. <laughs> yeah, you can talk to people too. If it teleports us, then it's something important anyway. And if not, then you can just yeah. ignore it. Francesco doesn't have to say something new. Is Alfred still in the storage room? Let me he's, not back, he's not back in the pool room yet. Mr. Winston, nothing new. Let's check the storage room. 
book still empty in the library? Bathroom Alfred is gone. Thing. He's gone? He's gone. Weird. He feels like he should be here then, but he's not. And he's probably somewhere else. Maybe in the yeah. library. Yeah, I didn't see anyone in the library, but I didn't really look for people. So I don't know. He's not in the bathroom. That much I can see for certain. I only see Charles in here, but I'll have a look around. <clears throat> yeah, no, there's no one. So he's not in the storage room. He's not in the pool room. Where else could he be? Hmm. He's not in the kitchen. Maybe he's in the garden. Yeah. Have not looked there. Nope. The gardener before me would ramble on about the particular sequence that you must plant your tulips in. The sequence is red, red, orange, white, pink, pink, white, orange, orange. Yeah, see, that was one of the previous maps. <laughs> I, do, I do remember that sequence being important, so yeah. I don't remember which one, which one it was, though. Anyway, I have no idea where Alfred could be. I haven't found him upstairs. Yeah, maybe he's, he's not. Gone. But why would he be gone? And where to? Uh, no one in the reading room. No, I think I'm done. Upstairs. If you're done downstairs, you could just advance the time. And then we'll have a look. What time is it? Eight. Eight. So early, early morning. Well, maybe not early morning, but morning. I think it's still early though. So, Alfred went to bed. <laughs> he was up all night and then he goes to bed at 7. Mm -hmm. Is he like a YouTuber? <laughs> Maybe. Maybe. Mr. Winston, nothing new. Or maybe he's like free because we did his quest and now the ghost is gone because whatever. I don't know. Maybe it just, yeah, maybe we have to do one quest for the ghost, but this, the, the gardener ghost is still there, so I don't know. That book is still empty. Charles doesn't have anything to say. Storage room. Gone. Hmm. Nothing here. Hmm. Mm hmm. I had to flip both levers. <laughs> and now something secret rooms have been revealed in the library. That makes sense. I was, I was thinking, maybe you can make that run in 30 seconds, and you can. I wonder if it would have worked if you flipped the other one, or if it would have not worked, because it's kind of cheaty. <laughs> so now, now, rooms now... Here, somewhere. Road to the side? Yeah. Yes. Oh, and straight ahead, too. Lots and of rooms. Up. Alright, let's go up. Not sure what we're looking for here. Oh, what's that? Nightmare. Before Christmas. <laughs> Free. <laughs> Stairs. Four. <laughs> oh, Nightmare. There's... And that's Alfred. Alfred. Don't you even sleep? <laughs> ah, the morning nightmare, my favorite. What? Okay, here we go. There's one. One is all red tulips. Are the other ones all the same color too? Yeah, this is all white tulips. So wait, I'll write that down. One red, two white. And then one is orange, one is pink. I don't know which one is which. Three is orange. Four is pink. That's the only color left. 
if you, you go write by the... down the sequence from the gardener? No, but I can score up in the thing. It's red, red, orange, white, pink, pink, white, orange, orange. That's right to left, though, which is weird. But that's the way the Cypress set it in that order. Left to right would be reversed. Can we do anything with these rocks? No. Huh. Strange. Hmm. But isn't, there's one more room back here, though. Oh, there's buttons here. One, two, three, four. And then there's a chest behind the gate. So maybe just do the order. Red, red, orange, white, pink, pink, white, orange, orange. So one, one. Right? Yeah, red is one. One, one. And then orange is three. Three. Two. Uh, two. Pink, pink, pink is, is four, four, four. White is two. Mm -hmm. And orange is three. Yes. Oh. <laughs> attic key, okay. Attic key, where's the attic Oh, and this is... I think we should read this now. The magical game has everything you need to fulfill your quest. Address each number and Kara as your test. <laughs> Reading this riddle may seem tricky, but one must have a colorful eye. Within a room is the illusion which will lead you to your conclusion. Passage 1. Room after room you may search, but if you wish to find the first clue, you must start from the beginning. One word from the first three paragraphs. Always starting with the first, leaving the rest to first. This book is the curse of which you need, can't you see? I don't know, should we read all the passages, I guess? Passage 2. Your second solution lies within the morning nightmare, each more terrifying than the last, with no hope of finishing the task. Escaping the illusion will only lead to confusion. Only in the center of it all you will see the solution. Passage 3. There is no winner in the game. We play only the fool who went astray. Alas, your fate is mine, and the curse of the late witch is your demise. Now you must run from this illusion, for the exit is your last solution. The Attic. That's that's everything. <laughs> Five, okay. <laughs> so, room of the room, you may search, but if you wish to find the first clue, you must start from the beginning. One word from the first three paragraphs. Always starting with the first, leaving the rest to first. This book is the curse of which you need. Can't you see? The reading room is the first clue, because the first three paragraphs start with the reading and then room. room. Okay. Did I get that book too? I did. Okay. Oh, I can't read it from here? I don't have a book. Okay, so we need to come back here to read all of this again, I guess. So the reading room is where we're headed. Which is over there. Oh, we have the attic key too. You got that, mm. right? Maybe let's have a look up there first. That's weird. What's up here? Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> some some kind of code, I guess. Zero zero zero. Might be just a three-digit code that we write. Yeah, you changed the number. And then that's the magical game. So we need the three passages give us three numbers, and then we enter the numbers, and then we open the door to the magical room or something. This is very elaborate. <laughs> Just keeps getting more and more complicated. And the task still free roam. <laughs> so in the reading room. Reading room. This the war. It says. And second was something about the center. I wish I could have brought that. Can we bring that book with us, actually? I go, I'll go back. You look around the room. <laughs> look for clues. How do, how do electrons work? You can't take books out of them, right? But how? Can't? You can, but how? 
is it like a shift right click or something? No. Isn't there like a way to do it? I don't know. Uh, always starting with the first, leaving the rest to first. This book is the curse of which you need, can't you see? The curse of which you need. I don't know. Maybe do something with the, did you get a copy of the book? Yep. You should have though, it says, no lift grower has received the magical game book. No, I didn't get a book. It says so though. <laughs> but it's not there. <laughs> Now I'll take screenshots of these pages, I guess. I still think there's a way to take out books, but I don't know. Maybe you need like a, I don't know. I, maybe I don't it's know. not the wall, maybe it's the hole. <laughs> I don't know. I would want to go through here somehow. Maybe later. Swore, no. Oh, yeah, maybe we need to time travel too. So what does the second paragraph oh, say? What? Something happened. You ate and go an apple. The book went away. Huh? Also, I think the third number is one. For the code. But what happened to my book? I was just spam right clicking it. Oh, it just came back. What? Oh, it, it was it was inventory glitched. <laughs> I guess that's why I couldn't read it. Now I can read it. <laughs> okay, it's just okay. So I'm pretty sure the third number is one, because um, the exit signs. I was wondering that last time too. It isn't an I. It's a one. It's X one T. Yeah, I saw that too. Yeah, so I'm pretty sure that's the last digit for the code or something. Or what about the, the hole <laughs> or the wall? So passage one. Room after room you may search, but if you wish to find the first clue, you must start from the beginning. One word from the first three paragraphs. Always starting with the first, leaving the rest to first. All of that is just the reading room. Yeah. This book is the curse of which you need. Can't you see? But th those are not, those are our text, right? There's no number up there. The war. Those are our letters. <laughs> yeah. I don't know which war are you talking about. I don't know. I don't know. I don't understand. <laughs> what we need to do. But then the second passage is the second solution lies within the morning nightmare. So we need to go into the nightmare somehow. And then Alfred was talking about the morning nightmare. Each more terrifying than the last with no hope of finishing the task. Escaping the illusion will only lead to confusion. Only in the center of it all you will see the solution. In passage 3, there is no winner in the game. We pray only the fool who went astray. Alas, your fate is mine, and the curse of the late witch is your demise. Now you must run from this illusion, for the exit is your last solution. I'm pretty sure the exit solution is 1. But I don't know what the first two numbers could be. The reading room, the war. I don't know. What, what does the war say? To me, nothing. It's a Pink Floyd song. Well, not really. It's an album, right? Songs is not a brick in war, right? <laughs> but I don't think that's the clue. And how do we get into the nightmare? In the night. The second solution lies within the morning nightmare, but it's the morning nightmare. It's the morning nightmare. I don't know. Alfred talked about the morning nightmare yeah. being his favorite, but what does that that's mean? All he says. The morning nightmare is pink. Maybe you have to book book two actually, and it's inventory glitch for you as well. Okay. Maybe click all your empty slots and see, and all your items like move them around in your inventory, see if something changes. Oh, there it is. Yeah. <laughs> 
Don't know why that gauge powered, but it did. Magic claim has everything you need to fulfill your quest. Address each number and color as your test. I found a secret room in the attic. Nice. I don't know what it does. So you... Is there nothing here? Not <laughs> just things I can't open. Barrels and chests. There's seriously nothing here? <laughs> Come on, game. <laughs> why would we, why would you hide a room with nothing in it? I don't know. Can I get back out? Yeah, I can. Um. Yeah, I don't really know. So the car is important too. Yeah. Nightmare has the same colors. What about the garden tulips? I don't know. We already used those. <laughs> The metal game has everything you need to fulfill your quest. Address each number and color as your test. Uh oh. What? You have to come to the garden. Sure. <laughs> What's wrong? There, there are weird sounds. Okay, not anymore. Oh, it was just me changing the numbers in the attic. Oh, I okay. I played for you too. <laughs> I was just cycling through the numbers to look at the cars too. Okay, I thought it has to do with the card. Hmm. So really the sequence was a code all along. Yes, it was. Maybe it's just the car. Maybe the car, the war in this room, red. Maybe red is the hint. I'm doing that. What color in the. In the reading room, the wars are red. Okay. Oh yeah, it's only this wall, which is red. So we do whatever red Oh yeah, that's free. the sound. <laughs> Freeze red. And then what was the second passage in Morning Nightmare? We can also just guess it now, because I think we have the other two locked in, but whatever. Your second solution lies within the Morning Nightmare, each more terrifying than the last, with no hope of finishing the task. Escaping the illusion will only lead to confusion, only in the center of it, or... You will see the solution. So the middle, maybe the, the middle center, letter, it... night, nightmare. What's the middle letter of nightmare? Night. T and it's tea. pink. The T is pink. Yes. <laughs> this is really loud. Oh god. <laughs> There's the door. Should we end the episode? It's kind of short, but it would be a good spot to do it, maybe. Okay. <laughs> yeah, sure. Let's do This is 33 minutes. This is a little short. For the last one, I had to be split. That's fine. That's fine. <laughs> this is it for today. Good. Oh, this is, the, this is the secret room, by the way. Oh, nice. There's nothing in there, but you can come in here and have a look. To ramble some more minutes. <laughs> No, just so you know where it is, in case, you know, whatever. We need it later. Yeah. Anything up here? No, all right. I don't know why this room exists. There will be something later, in, at another time. Maybe. Alfred will be know. hiding here. <laughs> yeah, he's eating something else. <laughs> I don't know. But yeah, I guess that's it for today now. We're making progress. This is, this is very good. We solved all three numbers, even though we just guessed the middle one. I'm proud of us. <laughs> and uh, our books are gone. Okay. Because so we, we don't need them anymore. It. Yeah. There's some, some stuff going in, on in there. There's some purple, some green stuff. I'm curious. But we'll find out next time. <laughs> <laughs> That's it for today. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And we'll see you then. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. <laughs>